What's up, Kathy? I just want to say something prayerfully. The people that need to hear this will motherfucking hear this. I got both shoulder blades touching each other because bitches got me fucked up. I'm on my Debo shit, bitch. I'm big old gangster Kevin Gates acting out this bitch. Listen, bitch. <laughs> Do you know what the fuck it takes to be with a black man? And I ain't talking to Becky. I'm talking to Boricua Bonita. BBQ, whatever the fuck your name is, Shamir, Bass Fish. Do you know what the fuck it takes to maintain a black man in the hills of North America? You don't, do you? None of you weird ass witchcraft working hoes do. You just want D I C K and some food. Bring it back the Bluntberry era. Like we need those problems with crack coming back. I know the fuck you lying. Bitch, what you doing? What you done did, bitch? But put fucking red clay dirt on your face. From nowhere kind of shit. Playing the fuck out of stupid. I'm so sick of these fucking black bitches. Wonder why they call you bitch. Wonder why they call you bitch. I bet you. Wonder why they call you bitch. Wonder why they call you bitch. I bet you. Leave black men the fuck alone. You turned them inside out, bitch. Take your hands off. You ain't God, bitch. With a marriage license, nobody cares. Throw them all in the middle of American streets and burn them because marriage is a fucking joke right now. Let's be very clear about it. If you're sleeping with somebody that's so-called married and they really want to be with you, you're married to them more than the bitch with the paperwork. Because it's a matter of souls, not a matter of paperwork. That shit is for taxes, wills, legacies, properties, shit like that. Earthly shit, bitch. Nobody cares. Nobody feels like they're sinning. What's it going to be? Are you going to be a blunt berry or a Baptist preacher? Huh? God damn, you got to be the black man. And bitch, you ain't never getting the credit for this because you hoes is the type that take black men's ball hairs and put it in a jar and then take his balls over the years till you can get to the 10 year mark so you can get a social security. And if you take them further than that, you make and kill them for some insurance money. Come on, country girls. Keep it real, bitch. Making beer disappear is your superpower. Where's my confederate flag? Fuck the bullshit. Mask off. Fuck it. Mask off. Fuck you think this is, ho ass bitch? You don't know enough to come fucking around in this yard. I got enough shit going on. I don't need pig and pigeon shit around here. I'm just trying to help the black man, bitch. I've helped plenty. Those that they sicked on me and those that I decided that I wanted to deal with and on top of the ones they sicked on me. Play me how? I don't play games. You can't play me. You only play yourself. You fuck yourself. Yes, you can still fuck yourself and be getting fucked every night. But a nigga that don't love you. If he were honest, kind of shit. Motherfuckers rearranged and strange out this bitch. Because bitches is tampering with black men's soul for their penis and their wallet. Don't care nothing about them. Treat them like a rag doll, like a buck in the Willie Lynch era. Like, it's disturbing as fuck. They're safer with white women. Trust me, good black girls. 
she might preserve them just in case it doesn't work out kind of shit. You would rather <laughs> you you would rather cause baby let me tell you something you can't be their mama that's the wrong way to go but you kind of gotta be cause they was thrown through a foster care system somebody molested them they mama got witchcraft it became an alcoholic a crackhead the adoptees was made to look like the better parent the adoptees be Jehovah Witness just trying to get social security money on the side so they can get their retirement, pull it down, and all this whole weird-ass shit. But everybody talking kingdom, and they all fucking gatekeepers. Don't solicit me for shit. They should start arresting Jehovah Witness. I'm in the Nation of Islam. We don't chase and beg and do all that shit and come find you and we force ourselves in your house. And all this whole weird-ass shit. You violate my rights, bitch. I'm not interested. If publishing clearinghouse was clear, so I'll open the door all day long. But that shit you talking about, I'm not interested. You can say what you want to. You can be mad all you want to. You can act pious all you want to. I don't care. What they got to do with me? Go sleep in front of your hall. Or your gate. Or whatever the fuck that is. Straight up. I was in mental institutions with Jehovah's Witness. I don't know what kind of witchcraft they got going on up in that motherfucker. I'm not interested. I was married to two. Definitely not interested. Still, you feel me, Cappy? Don't invite me to shit on a Saturday or a Sunday. I ain't coming. I'm grown, that's why. The fuck you got in that punch? You want to kill me, motherfucker? You seem like you want to be a leader of so what the fuck you think this is? Hire a slave? Kind of country dumb shit y'all got going on where it's coming across this motherfucking feed. And I don't fuck with that Mississippi shit. I don't. I don't know nothing about it and don't want to. And my prayers are to you. <laughs> Them niggas, they ain't white folks they got to worry about. You better help pray to God there's some Confederate flags coming soon like a motherfucker. And spark up the sage and the incense when you see them. Along with some burning crosses since they know who to get this time kind of shit. Fuck what you talking about. Fuck what you heard, bitch. <laughs> Motherfucker gotta eat. Motherfucker hungry. You ain't talking about shit. Motherfucker been so fucking starving. <laughs> bitch, what? Motherfucker been in survival. Motherfucker been in Cold War. White like me, bitch. I don't deny no Italian or Irish in me. You gotta be out your fucking mind. You deny yourself, that's your business, bitch. Just like you being a Jehovah Witness is. Blocking marriages. Move out of the way, bitch. Don't do that. You get your head knocked off fucking with a law. A law ain't Jehovah. Jehovah is Jay Z as far as I'm motherfucking concerned. Bitch, today's over. Today's over. Not guilty. Those who do not feel me are not real to me. Therefore, you don't exist. So, poof. That most son of a bitch. Who you roll? Change the outcome. Yeah, some people want y'all dead. And some people serve as a fucking hero. And change the outcome. Some people that y'all may think y'all enemies was. And they gonna turn and be your friends. I ain't lying. It's like that. Let's see what plan is affecting y'all Capricorn. Motherfuckers ain't as dumb as they act, trust me. Leo, biggest enemy. Cancer. Taurus. 
For real. Niggas is in it to win it. They making all kind of power moves. So they don't got to starve. And they can get their motherfucking mind right. And their money right. Since they ain't dying. You know, they doing plenty killing. But sometimes a motherfucker realize they done touched the wrong one. You know? And shit be going real bad. And they un get unstupid all of a sudden. Sometimes they'll make the choice and decision to burn a bridge. Just to change the narrative or the outcome or something. Because they be having an inside track on what these motherfucking witches be doing. You wouldn't know. Like fucking with my dice. Let's see what planet is affecting y'all. Some nutcase Virgo with mirror magic. Or moon magic. A lot of secrets. A lot of secrets. For real. Y'all gonna have a Leo. That's an enemy. Or they got Leo in their chart. They could have changed sides. I don't know. I don't know. But they was no good, venomous, all that. That's what y'all surrounded around. The users, opportunists, frauds, liars, fake, name drop. So you think they got something that they don't? Virgo. Not the weirdo Virgo using mirror magic. This somebody that met a new Virgo. Somebody that got some spiritual weight. More than likely a Capricorn. Mermaid energy. Nipsey. Nipsey on somebody baby mama's ass. A no good venomous energy harvester. Mirror magic worker. Pick up anything. Got supernatural powers on the dark side. Kind of bitch. Know more about you than you know about her. Type of bitch that collect testicle hairs of black men. To take their balls and trap them with babies that ain't theirs. And tell the children. And have a greater alliance with the children than the man. Because they realize the children is where the money at. Not the man. Because they done ran out of money. Ten years. Then, you know, before they know it. Ten years don't went by. They slowly trying to kill them. Take their balls. Do all kind of shit. Like a weird science. It's like a Yakub. Tribe of Shabazz. Never reform. Once a slave. Always a slave. Weird. Shouldn't have never came here kind of motherfucker. Run, can of shit, and fuck you. Bitch, let the white man figure it out. For real. That's one thing I like about Joe Biden. Y'all know I talk to Joe Biden on the phone? I always tell that story. He got mad at me. Like, dude, what do you mean? I'm tired. I'm not coming nowhere. You got to work for black people. <laughs> And of course, a uh, sellout airy sister always wants to call me. Oh, you should meet my sister. She's amazing. <laughs> Trying to not, you know, want to play shy brother all the time. You know, let's play shy brother. Listen, I'm asleep, man. <laughs> Y'all. I'm talking to an uh, irrelevant person on the phone. And my line clicked. So I clicked over. It beep, you know. Zo, zo. What the fuck is this? See, it's her number. Sus. <laughs> sounded like <laughs> sounded like he was black up. You know, my fucking sus. What's up? <laughs> Ain't nothing up. <laughs> you should come down here. Hey, but help me out down here. Get the campaign with me. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. No. I'm asleep. I'm tired. Where's my sister? Put her on the phone so I can fucking cuss her out. For having you call me. Honey, baby. I understand you're the vice president, but I'm asleep. And I'm on the phone with a weirdo. And I'm agitated, you know. <laughs> He felt slighted. His little ego, the little Irish in him. The Irish in him and the Irish in me were like. <sighs> <laughs> 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 
Bye, them. <laughs> Divine Nancy Land. Divine Feminer. What's up, y'all? Honey, baby. People is in a world of trouble, honey. People is so in a world of trouble. Baby, unraveling, honey. If they interrogated them, they would have, honey, mobile crisis, ambulance, all that on standby to put their ass in a mental facility. Straight jacket action. What are you talking about? Do you know what year it is? Do you know who the president is? Or a prison cell? These motherfuckers ain't about to have no choice. No choice. Honey, baby. Honey, baby. I was in Dunkin' Donuts the other day. I seen this cute little white girl. And they th I thought they were coming to order, but they had a mobile order. So they thought they were cutting me. They weren't cutting me. I was just waiting there. I wasn't in line. I had already ordered. I thought they was trying to order in store, but they had a mobile order. So it kind of went like this. So he was like, hey, you know, just cut in front of people. It was his granddaughter. White men love their grandchildren. <laughs> You may not think your child man, valuable. You may not think your grandchild shit, you know, just a little nappy-headed nothing nigga. But, baby, <laughs> let me tell you about the Puritan white man. He just kissed her on her forehead. She was like, looking like, excuse me, lady, but I'm trying to get my order. I said, y'all can go ahead. I don't want to I don't want to no smoke. I don't want to no smoke. You're cute. She was like, I know. <laughs> I was like, Whoa. What is your sign, honey? He was like, yeah, she got a birthday coming up. Oh, she got a birthday coming up. Of course she was a Virgo. I said, oh, typical, typical, whatever. Then she was trying to move towards the door. Because I dropped my car. She was trying to move, get some more conversation. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. See? You smelt that syrup, did you? That juice? That punch. Now you want to be my friend. Virgo. Did I say the wrong thing? Now you asking yourself. Analyzing. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. I shouldn't have did that. Ugh. Why would I say it, such a thing to her? I can't, oh, she's cool, man. No, I want to talk to her. I'm a Virgo. I want to know. Who is this girl? Who is this lady? A Virgo, too. I'm the 13th. She's the second. I need to talk to her. Virgos understand, granddad. They be on some other shit. <laughs> they, trying to, they trying to compete with them Chinese folks. On the intellectual side. Hello, somebody. Meanwhile, we stuck in the mud by Aunt Jemima's that block you from getting basic needs as a channeler or a seer or whatever you need. If you watch any Matrix movie, if you watch anything dealing with oracles, they have to have cigarettes. They have to have some form of tobacco. Hello, somebody. If you're Native American, baby, let me tell you. I think I got a chance in my bones. I said the feeling that I got going on and on. Honey, baby. It's to secure the cigarettes, bitch. <laughs> Honey, send my money, Honey. Honey. Mr. Honey, Mr. Honey, <laughs> Mr. Honey, it's in my mind. Yeah, though I walk, nigga, through the hood to get my motherfucking shot, nigga. Why you blocking, bitch? I ain't trying to get rich. <laughs> I'm trying to get a message, oh. Move. Stanky booty. <laughs> Thank you, bitch. Y'all got down in the Delta. <laughs> For real. Snaky, coachy ass bitch. Now everybody, you're in yellow and everybody's drinking hella alkaline water. Hello, some honey. Honey, spring water, alkaline honey. It will do whatever. Switch it up. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> Who don't do what, bitch? But just just drink liquor from KC to KC. They got every black female piss and tang. Look at this this color coming up. You know what I mean? <laughs> just 
terrible. Terrible. You terrible. What are you going to do with a man when you don't even know what to do with your body? Let alone his body outside of use testicle hairs. Like you collecting specimen for the coroner's office or some shit. Like for the crime department. Bitch, you are a murderer and a weirdo. Gargamel. Who told you? Ain't enough counseling in the world, bitch. Get in that hole or get in that motherfucking mental hospital. Get in that gown and shut up. Miss Supernatural Powers. There be plenty of them in there. Crazy as a fuck. Talk about they breaking generational curses, but then big and for me, it's in the next five goddamn minutes. Like, what's it gonna be? Fuck. Destiny. Marie Laveau energy. Destiny. Let's break her down. Hey, Tony Tang. How are you doing, Tony Tang? Hey, girl. Hey, girl. Hey girl, hey girl. Can y'all see that? Cappy? Happy cappies. Hot packages. <laughs> Man, y'all, y'all brothers, brothers, y'all all right? Sisters, y'all good? <laughs> Brothers, y'all all right? Y'all pissing tang too? <laughs> Good grief. Girl. Honey, these bitches. Oh, all they do is steal, 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 steal. Steal other people's ideas. Make a man think that they got an idea and they want to do that. Then they fall through. They got to go find somebody else to try to be like, okay, now I want to do this and I want to add this to this. That's what they deal with spirituality. Use it like it was a great whore. You know, if somebody wanted to entrap a whole bunch of dummies, then yeah, flood the internet with that. Honey, <laughs> you guaranteed, honey, to get a whole slew of dumbasses misusing sacred knowledge. Honey, baby, bye. Some of y'all about to reap a lover. I want to be your lover. I want to be your brother and your sister too. There is no other. I'm telling you. Some of y'all be texting long ass messages. Some of y'all yeah, an avid reader. Some of y'all read a lot. Some of y'all reflex people like that. Some of y'all may have like typed a lot, text a lot, long shit, then realize, ah, uh, people not. They take too long to get back to me, or, yeah, let me tell you. But you can type as fast as you can read. So people be like, God damn. I know an avid reader. It's not easy. For real. It's not easy. People like real simple text messages. I love to read. I'm an avid reader. When you're an avid reader, that shit don't bother you. You read it like it's a short text. Like it's in shorthand. You be a long ass shit that gotta be converted over to a multimedia or something. You read that shit like it's a sentence for real when you're an avid reader. And it's interesting too. And you wanna know what somebody has to say and it's intriguing. Readers know what the fuck I'm talking about. You get through a text like that. I've had men say something about that. Like, how the fuck are you texting me that fast? Even if they try to go paragraph, it'd be pressure to go beyond that. Because I will go through the paragraph like I'm looking at. <laughs> Somebody say, shake my head. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> it's true. I love books. My mother used to leave me in bookstores. She would go shopping, Pisces, leave me in um, B, what was it, B Dalton's or something like that. I don't know. Borders. It didn't matter. Any bookstore. Joseph Beth's. They closed Joseph Beth's. I go to. I had to go way out. Sometimes. I don't know. Let's go to Billion Books. 
I don't know if they still open. I would love to look it up and see. Yeah, I can't go without a book. I'm not a Kindle person. I need a book. I'm like, Oprah, I need a book. Give me a book. <laughs> I want to put that little marker in it. Even if I want to fold the page down, get back to it. It's just a vibe. Some of y'all are avid readers. End of a dark night of the soul. I used to read Sweet Valley High Girls with Elizabeth and Jessica. That was my jam. I wanted to live in California my whole last life. Just to be like, California! Still ain't make it. God damn! What do a girl got to do to make it out of the ghetto? I thought Einstein said imagination was all I needed! <laughs> For real. Could have been a love child. Could have been a love child. Honey, y'all ain't gonna have no choice but to have a baby by this person. That's fucked up. I mean, if you don't want to, you know, I don't, I don't really want no more children. I'm cool. I don't know what's going on with my son. I don't know what these people got their plans on. You know, they plots and they hands and they pens and they weird vibes and they weird minds and their pocketbooks and their weird shit and their dogma and their cults and their weird fetishes and their sexual obsessions and their mental pedophilia and their surveillance and shit. I don't know. I don't know. You know? I wasn't planning on having it on. I said I was done at 45. I really did. 45? Listen, let me tell you something. Forget about it, buddy. I'm 44. And I don't, nobody in here. Ain't nobody coming here. Mindset. This is a Capricorn read. <laughs> My story, this is your story. Some of y'all listening to Osho. If not, go to Osho International. Yeah, he'll put something on your mind. He'll get you together. He'll wake up that lion in you, especially if you're a black man. Wake that lion right up. <laughs> wake that lion right up, honey. Any cowardly lion that's thinking they're a lion just because they got a few bucks and they think they're about to pimp you out, like pimp they ride kind of shit. They think that you a book or a slave, or they about to do something with you and sell you off. Man, black people off into some weird shit, man. Because they've been off into that weird shit, man. They just, I mean, the truth is being told about that motherfucking ass. You take it, or throw a fucking scotch shot back and forget it, baby. However you want it, bitch. I ain't God. I'm a God, but I ain't no law. Honey, let me tell you something. Arm, leg, leg, arm, head. Reaping season. For good girls. Like Khalees and shit. The sage. The sages. The sages and the good girls. Having babies. Niggas with dreadlocks. Crazy bald heads and niggas with dreadlocks. Sages. A lot of black people that sages have dreadlocks right now or they're bald. That are black men. I was talking about black men. White people be hella interested, especially if the white lady with a black man. I mean, you would like to know, wouldn't you? I'm sure Twitch wife, I mean, could have went leaps and bounds watching this channel. <laughs> Since he seemed to be struggling with his own personal choices and witches that, you know, can't get enough of the black D that's not theirs. Because they ain't God and they didn't birth them. Kind of shit. Weird hoes, man. Let me tell you something. 
Some black like men send desiring, honey. <laughs> Growing their little locks. Look at their little locks, y'all. Oh, they just now started. That's the starters. Y'all see they starters? I seen somebody walking out. I see a oh, these are unfinished here, boy. Weak foundation, major lesson, repeating cycle. I see a buy unfinished here and close the door. <laughs> yeah, like the center done. If somebody got mad, probably a bitch. You know, like, listen. I am a black man in the hills of North America. Do you know what it took for me to get here and not die? Can this shit, even if it's from fucking famine starvation, bitch, it's hot outside. Would you like to offer a nigga some water? And not spit in it, bitch. Uh, uh, I, uh, I'm sorry, I... Oh, can I get something for you, baby? <laughs> Everybody that's black and white, fuck that shit. Hip-hop is culturally fucking colorful as fuck. Hip-hop rules the world, nigga. <laughs> white fathers know it. You gotta go ahead and say it, say it. Anyway. <laughs> Everybody... Just imagine Kendrick Lamar's face on the, on the album cover. Damn. <laughs> Honey, when you find out people, baby. Honey, who they really be? Who they really be? If a black man right now got from up under a self-hatred, weird bitch, keep him in a jar, stay threatening them, stay in the graveyard, binding them and all this whole weird ass shit, man, if <laughs> he go back to that shit, he better haul ass be a detach, a detach, a mission, cut the cord. Because when I say disgusting, when I say you gotta be a whole ass gangster to even fuck with it, I let my BD have the last shot that I knew was the last shot because I wanted to cut the cord on him. I did a blood ritual when I married him. You feel me? <laughs> uh uh. I need this off. So I gotta do what I gotta do. Baby, disgusting. See the whole. I ain't advising y'all to do this because you shouldn't have to deal. If you could just get the fuck on away from them. whoever this weird, self hatred, envious bitch, envious of you. Like you're literally, some of y'all Capricorn men are literally sages, like spiritually, like highly spiritual beings. And they wanna be you. A woman that y'all was with. Act like they extra spiritual and shit. They want to be you. They hate you. Could be gay. Could not be into men at all. Could have just been with you to doppelganger you with that shit. Some weird shit. That ain't got nothing to do with nothing. Oh, it was the most disgusting experience ever. Ever. I literally had to watch a like Demon Time. But cut cord. Never returned. Mission accomplished. Not for pleasure. No. Oh, no. Uh, my mother's talking about, I raised a gangster. Honey, baby, I was raised by one, honey. Let me tell you something. Don't let nobody tell you nothing to do. King of air. Don't reshuffle whoever the new person is. It may be a king of air, Capricorn winning, Gemini. Um, y'all know Aquarius, Libra. Don't reshuffle. Some of y'all did candle magic, got rid of a stanky ass ex man, and called in the king of air. Don't reshuffle. Uh uh. It may be somebody that's resurfacing that realized you was a good person, and they a sage too. Kind of tall fella. And butterscotch color. But a lot of black men that are sages, look up what a sage is. That's one word my mother showed me in the hospital. The word sage. That I was a sage, but I don't know. But I don't know these men on here. 
this is sage. I think sage is a woman. Sage would be a woman, I guess. I was like, what? Got heavy as fuck. Just slid down the wall like in the movies, real time. What? No acting. Some shit will literally do that to you. Acting, bitch. You been ooh. You need to shut the fuck up. Weird ass hoes. Bad. Ooh, if y'all see a deer, that's confirmation. Did the bitch been wearing a mask? The bitch stinky coochie. Some of y'all want to know, do y'all got children? Is the children yours? Ancestors, are the children theirs of these stinky coochie self-hatred? Baby mamas used to be married to no more. Are the children theirs? Damn. It was kind of like a wedding opportunity. Just wanted to get married kind of shit. But what does that have to do with if the children is theirs or not? Body, mind. Oh, shit. Think these motherfuckers is crazy for real they do a lot of tampering with y'all body and mind through the food you know like what kind of weird shit is this like <clears throat> who would it come up to be you know I'm talking tricky I'm talking about put a whole other man's sperm in your food you won't even know uh, like some weird shit. Like trying to hide something. Some of y'all are writers, rappers, actors, singers, motivational speakers are supposed to be sage energies. Are these children ears? I'm gonna have to pull it from another deck, y'all. Stroke of good luck. Because y'all have to find it out. They don't want y'all to, but some of y'all are like, yeah, I want to know. Because I'm going to go off this answer and say, fuck a blood test. That's how you're supposed to operate in Aquarius age. For real. Especially if y'all got children by somebody and they done birthed a bad witch because they is one. Or turn somebody good or bad. Or hey, you got to dump that whole shit. Dump that whole shit. Nowadays, this ain't time to save the world. Uh -uh. It's trying to save yourself. <laughs> are these children Capricorns? Male Capricorns, are they their children? Yes, but let's go further because they tricky, y'all. I ain't lying to you. They've been fucking with Dex. If you're a tarot reader, you know what the fuck I'm talking about. This ain't no trick show. This ain't no motherfucking movie. Ain't none of that shit. Literally two cards in, wrong answer. Then two cards forward, right answer. I ain't lying. You ain't manipulating nothing. Ain't wanting to say something different. No. They literally trying to change, you know. Supernatural powers? What the fuck you think this is? You can work through some cards and make it say something. It is. It's like a Ouija board. That look like a wedding ring to me. Clarify. Mm -hmm. In it for money. For real. In it for money. Strictly money. I mean, wedding opportunity, money. Are the children someone else's? If this bitch or bitches can get out of my mix for a minute. Is... I'm picking up on a Capricorn that wants to know if the children that you bear with these stinky coochies is yours. I don't know how many of you it is. I don't know if it's just one. But y'all got some tricky bitches. Uh-uh. It ain't. It was magic. I'm telling you. They really did. Tricky. 
where you wouldn't even be able to figure it out. Like, gotta let it come out in a wash. Like, at your funeral or some shit. That old country back row bullshit. That movie color purple shit. <laughs> How they die on top of me. A lot of weird shit that I would involve myself in. I just wouldn't. Because time is of the essence and life is too short. And, I mean, it's kind of like self-abuse to just keep sitting somewhere and letting people abuse the fuck out of your kindness. That's, that's kind of crazy. They sick. These motherfuckers are sick. 15 to 30. Some of y'all got 15 to 30 year olds. They mentally sick. They really is. They is. They mother manipulator working on them. I just said something about the Jaguar. What did I say about the Jaguar, y'all? Ancestors, please bring it to my, my... Oh, the car. I said the Jaguar car is fucking up because there's something going on with the Jaguar animal. Something going on with the black Jaguar animal for a very long time because Jaguar's been fucking up for a very long time, too. I don't know. What they, what, what, what's the correlation? Why are they making them vehicles fuck up? But the names alone is like spell work, if you want to say that shit. Energy is energy. Yeah, some of y'all in a life or death situation. Y'all got to get out of there. Wherever y'all at. Or whoever y'all with. Or whatever y'all got holding y'all back. They have to catch up with you. On some real shit. You ain't trying to be funny or nothing. Mm -mm. Till people find harmony and figure out what's what. I would just leave wherever I'm at that's causing me the most stress. Because scared money don't make money. Stress money don't make money. And it's sad that I have to talk about money in order for Capricorns to hear me. But y'all are so gone off that shit. I don't know why. It could be that people been using you where, you know, it makes you look like you're addicted to money. When it's really just them using you to work to give people money. Because y'all do. Y'all take care of, if y'all in a relationship, y'all gonna take care of who y'all with. It's like y'all more addicted to work than money. That's why this body and mind came up. Because it's affecting y'all body and y'all mind at this point. Because you would want to stop working and wouldn't be able to. Or get depressed because you could, you you don't have to go to work that day. And you would think, oh, I can, ah, oh, shit, I love it, da, 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 da. Yeah. <laughs> Ask a motherfucker that retired after working for 60, 70 years. How easy it was to just, you know. <laughs> adjust to doing nothing. But y'all need to. For real. Somebody mad? They're just envious of you. Envious of your life. They must, yeah, they see your birth chart or something. I'm telling you, watching on social media. Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Crazy as a fuck. Man or woman, it doesn't matter. Uh-huh. Gotta have courage. Whatever y'all moving on to, it's gonna be good. Some of y'all need to check y'all blood pressure. If you're older, if y'all got grandparents, check on them about that blood pressure. As long as they ain't no dark witch. Don't put yourself in no crazy situation trying to be extra helpful. Then ain't we that's what we talking about? <laughs> Motherfuckers is nuts. Any way to reel you in, honey. If you got a sweet granny, honey, make sure granny cool and her blood pressure ain't because somebody trying to do something to her, trying to get her to stroke her out. Or, you know, check on your peoples, the ones that you know your peoples. And ain't no motherfucking weirdo that's killing your peoples. You feel me? The ketchup and mustard girls. Some of y'all need to ground y'all energy, sit up under a tree. For real, some of y'all around manipulators. If they can't, I mean, that's like when I used to do hair. Bitch, you ain't about to rush me when I gotta feed my body to stand and do more of what I'm doing on you. Don't you get a lunch break at work? Okay, so why the fuck you looking at me stupid? Because I'm about to go take a lunch break. Kind of shit. That kind of shit. Like, don't play with me. Do I need to call the Better Business Bureau up in this bitch? Or the city or whatever? 
For real. You be having to stand up for your rights because motherfuckers will turn you into a slave in a minute. You need certain time when you're under certain pressure, especially as a black man or an older black person. What the fuck? Hold up a minute. Fuck you do you what the fuck you think this is what you trying to kill me for some insurance money or say I'm crazy and lock me up in a nut house to get some goddamn money with your weird ass. You gotta use more than emotional intellect with a manipulator. You gotta show them better than you can tell them. And when they pull up on you, when you're doing something to better yourself or to nourish yourself or to maintain your equilibrium because you got locks or you a naturalist or something like that, you you need time, motherfucker. You motherfuckers use black men in these small cities, but then when they gotta do what they do a certain way, whether it's to go smoke a cigarette, a cigar, do something. You all over them like white on rice and a white man ain't even all over them like that. Who the fuck is you, nigga? Is you down or ain't you, nigga? Don't nobody care about your little money, cuz. And? Fuck that got to do with it. You better quit touching my crown, bitch. I don't know you, nigga. Blocking. Jehovah Witness, move the fuck out the way. For real, y'all know y'all been out of line. Farad waiting to get y'all the business. You want to stir up? Let's stir up, bitch. I'm not scared of no Jehovah's Witness. Fucking psychos. Always trying to hook somebody up. That shit is an escort service like a motherfucker. Always in Hawaii. Fuck y'all getting all this bread from. Steadily in the ghetto, but it's steadily deteriorating. There ain't nobody changing. But you steadily teaching that which you know not. So says Jay Rutherford. Don't oh, get me to channeling up in here. Ground your energy like you need to, black man. And anybody pull up on you with that bullshit, tell them to go to fuck to hell. And if you seeing somebody and you need to have a conversation and you feel peace from a person that you seeing that these motherfuckers trying to block because they trying to feed y'all karmics all motherfucking day, tell the motherfucker to hold on a minute. You need to get somebody some money or you need to do what a man's supposed to do. These motherfuckers is men just like you. Y'all already have a father. You don't need a father. If this motherfucker want to act like a boss, tell him to be one and be more like the white man than the fucking nigga that think he run the plantation now. Study the white man, then maybe you would know how to act, nigga. The fuck? Weird ass niggas. Fang your balance. Plenty dark nights to come because y'all was fucking with soul twins and, you know, with karmics. You know, you tied your soul up to them. Everybody got a soul. They just can't find theirs. They always in a dark night. They find balance to you. So now, you just have to go through some dark nights in order to purge them out of your motherfucking DNA. You can do it. It ain't no big deal. If you would have had sex with somebody that was a healer like you, then it would be alchemy. But some of y'all can't get two people because these different weird religions and witches and warlocks blocking people because they're trying to be it on you know people like y'all slaves like bucks and fucking mammies they have black women breastfeeding they black babies in a minute for real these niggas done lost their mind for real and you gotta help them find it when they come with that dumb shit just put the lantern out like the virgo with the sense in their head not the weird stalker crazy bitch or bitch ass nigga Oh, somebody mother. Honey, let me tell you something. Firecracker is an understatement. I mean, I had a chrome mother, ancestor energy. Rarely do I pick up people that are still, you know. And I say, your mama or your grandma, my son, just so y'all get acclimated to the channel and somebody is no longer here. You know, for real. I channel too many people. So, and I do it all day long. And I don't have a problem with it. I like to be on a, I read on a separate level, so it doesn't bother me. 
I don't bother them. They don't bother me. I have a house full of people right now. And it, wouldn't, it don't bother me. It's just as peaceful like an ashram up in this boy. Nobody no weird over around here. <laughs> Nuts. Surrender to complete healing. President Abraham Lincoln. Uproot evil. Help a black man today, white man in the Buckeye State. Help a black man today. <laughs> Hell no, the home of surveillance. Help a black man in need today. That you see fit and worthy from what you know you watching on your surveillance. Show be to tell him. Ain't nobody dumb. Look like I've been around niggas. Know you niggas. Little do you know. <laughs> Patterns, configurations. Data, as they like to say. The father. I'm trying to tell you. White man about to be getting them some black uh, God sons and gonna have them a hallelujah good time. Ain't gonna be no cult, no weird shit. She a prime opportunity to raise a son. A soul to soul connection. Yep. A motherfucker can say what they want and gonna get their fronts knocked the fuck out. For real. Because some people want to preserve the black race just like some white people want to preserve the white race. And it's nothing fucking wrong with that. Every other race does it. What the fuck is the problem with blacks and whites doing it? I don't understand. It's such a fucking joke. <laughs> For real. Hello? No, up to no good all the time. How the fuck are you going to reproduce with some shit like that anyway? Every man, listen, everybody ain't birthed in LeBron James, honey. <laughs> like, for real. Come on, man. Come on, Capricorn. He's a Capricorn, honey. Help me this evening, can you shit? Where your mama at? Glow. <laughs> you right? Y'all know what this is. Y'all know what this is, honey. Some of y'all got a brand. Some of y'all do jewelry. Like me, make bracelets. Some of y'all want bracelets. I'm going to be doing bracelets, not giveaways. I already did giveaways. I love to do it. They work. They the bomb. They last forever, man, dude. But some people should be breaking. My hematite ring broke in my sleep. These hoes trying to, like, what the fuck, bitch? Can I get my thumb back in my sleep? Kobe, man, what the fuck? Like broken half. I'm trying to get it off. It just burst. Hey. How the fuck up? <laughs> How the fuck up, bitch? You breaking hammer type, bitch? That's this shit. <laughs> uh, roots and shit. Grounding. Hematite is for grounding mostly. Motherfucker's trying to break ground. Fuck around and broke what needed to be broke for a motherfucker that's overworked. Because, honey, a woman will overwork a Capricorn man, dog you. Use you like a dog. For real. Capricorn men are so easily taken advantage of. Capricorn women are not like that. They see exactly what's going on here. Kind of shit. Whether you potential or whether they just going to talk to you for this little minute. and But this ain't nothing. And this ain't nothing. <laughs> I had Capricorn clients. I had a Capricorn brother. A Capricorn nephew. Capricorn friends. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Dated one for half a second. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I know what about that motherfucker, man. I don't like this one. By marriage. 
And she one of them, you know, you ain't mad at her. You know what I'm saying? My mother, girl, girl. Good witch, yeah. Ain't play no games. I don't wanna play no games, play no games. Fuck around, give you my last name. I know you're tired of the same damn thing. That's okay, cause baby, you, you got it, girl, you got it, girl. Yeah. You got it, girl, you got it, girl. Somebody say, Chris Brown can't sing. That's whining. Why? Where are you at right now, motherfucker? Y'all be talking crazy under them IG pictures. Where the fuck are you at right now saying that? In your bed, eating what? He can't do what? Bitch, you couldn't travel as much as he can, let alone sing. And still have your breath and your wind and not get blood clots from being cooped up on a plane or a fucking mode of transportation all motherfucking day dancing forever for however many people you know how much power that boy holds and i'm saying boy because honey that's my nigga but you bet not who the fuck you talking to troll can't stand these motherfuckers barely can hold down a job but so highly opinionated about what somebody sound like well goddamn there's a whole arena full of motherfuckers state to state backyard to yard country to country Thinking this nigga is amazing. And you're who again? I'm always trying to diminish somebody's motherfucking hard work. Because these motherfuckers hardly work. And now they got shit where they can use their fingers. They ain't going to open their fucking mouth to let you see their retard. They let it come through their fingers. To show you how blind, deaf, and dumb they really is. Like, shut up. Who do you work for? Who sent you? That's when you got to go down on Trump on them. Who do you work for? Who sent you? <laughs> for real, man. These people been out of line, been out of time, need to go the fuck head on. Love and like Cappy and make the right choice. Y'all seem to have a good person. Y'all done made my, look at that. She cleaned that like that. Whoa. Whoa! The best one of the day. Her and El Bougay. Psalms 23. Got that Kali. That Sharifa, that Khalifa. You know what I'm saying? Aki. I'm out of here. I don't have time for this no more. <laughs> I'm about to go eat me some chips and dips. And be black like me, honey. Marie Laveau, Virgo, stand up. The real ones. Not the weird bitches that stay in graveyards. But the ones that potentially have the same capacity to be so fucking dope. And born in 18, fucking 18. But have people try to literally pick up your fucking big ass tombstone. And take it with them. So they could make it more sacred and do it right and people ain't gonna do it right these is white men they gotta watch them i don't even know if they let people in there no more they stole my original i had an original she worked through somebody in louisiana to get it to me for a hundred bucks had it framed a photographer took her store original uh the funeral the the the, the graveyard where she was buried uh another landmark that was relative to her she got it to me. The girl, the, the girl that got this for me, her name Katie. She was a white girl. She never had heard of Marie Laveau. She from a small town in Louisiana. Ain't that crazy? Never heard of her. She was like, um, somebody's trying. She was a channeler. She said somebody's trying to come through. She says her name's Marie Laveau. I said, are you serious? She was like, yeah. I was walking past this painting and it said Marie Laveau. And she told me to call you to see if you wanted it. <laughs> I'm like, you don't know who Marie Laveau is and you live in Louisiana? She's like, no. It's just, just. She said, I'll send it to you. She said, I, she said I'm going to ask him how much he wants for it. She took a picture of it and sent it to me. I'm like, oh, hell no. I'm like, hell yeah, send that bitch. He wanted $100. And I think she ended up paying 
a part of it or something as a gift to me. Something real sweet. I can't remember what part of Louisiana they're from. I really can't. I can't. Maybe it ain't meant for me to say nothing so they won't attack them. Maybe they're trying to get themselves together. They got some sons of anarchy shit going on around here. I wouldn't fuck with you. <laughs> Virgo. Happy. I'm uh, loving life. 